Kode Guyana. My name is Raphael Waldron, Masquerade Bank from Victory Village, the leader for the Victory Lucky Star Bank. I in Masquerade like about 37 years now, and I come from my ancestors. But before I you know, attack a little issue of Masquerade, I want to wish everybody in Guyana, whatever what race, just want wish everybody in Guyana happy emancipation day and around the world who view us. Because we know the pandemic, we gotta do everything inside. But just saying, get a little action we on the road. Anyway, I danced in my career 37 years now, and my brother was the founder of me. He taught me how to dance masquerade. And I tour a lot around the world with, you know, guidance get carfest and I go a very lot of places with him, like New York, AT, Caribbean country, you know. So I know I try to up keep the sport because we know that the African tradition is dying out. And as a leader for my band, I think it's wise to bring the youths to keep the tradition up alive. But we know the, the crisis, you know, we, we ain't get enough time. You know, the sponsorship is one of the main part of us to showcase the talent we have in Guyana. But masquerade is one of the oldest African tradition in Guyana. I come from a small village that named Victoria Village. And I could remember my brother and my late mother and father telling me, when I buy Victoria Village, because I feel like the first village you could understand where the first village buy with slavery. But when I bought it, they used to use a big bar room. And you have a main shop on the road front, it's a shop now, but I said that there was a, a bank. So then you used to take, take the big bar room and push around the village, and people used to put kind in the big bar room. So, so come, they went and put kind in the big bar and raise the money to buy Victoria Village. But my masquerade history comes from, from my father. I started dancing from nursery school. A lot of people in Guyana might know me as a mad cow man. I told right away around the world as mad cow. A lot of people might know me. Little one, big one, everybody gonna know me. But Victoria have a lot of history. And I'm glad I on this year to, to enlighten people about Victoria. So you gotta take a walk to Victoria and see the roots of Victoria. Because right now Victoria have the most masquerade man. Well, I got into mass career from in North Sea School car. At the time, he used to have mass games. And I used to go to my big brother's school, knowing how well he dancing, because he was one of the top dancers. At that time, he had born I'm Amit and Green. At the time, I used to keep mass, he had paint and smack it. So when I go there now, my brother said, No, you can't come here you now because you're too small. I cry. But the teacher take them back in school, so when I take them in school now, I decide to go under the bus seat. So when I do come out to the bus at Pentas, I come now crying. So I'm telling you, say, why are you against me by crying? So I'm bringing over my brother to and say, you want to dance man school, but you cannot dance. And I say, put it on the stage. And when I entered the stage, I was the only by like the price on that stage. And from then, I elevate myself and turn more on Guyana, most recognizing masquerade dancer. Representing Ghana the highest level in the world. Till I, I farm a home band, which is the Victoria Lucky Star. And right now, I'm the present champion in the masquerade industry. One of them, because I come to the greatest. Like Portuguese, the great Portuguese for Guyana, when he does blow with me. But probably get one foot now, so you know, he cannot move around with us. But we, she is great. I tell this sport, I like this sport. This sport, and how I like this sport, I will do nothing for it. So if we get people now who could come and you know, just embrace the youth, you know, finally walk shops around the place and so let them see how African tradition still standing up to this level. I touch all part, watch. I touch, I dance as the, the one of the most successful mass foot, flat foot masquerade dancer. The best in the world is cow. The mad cow was where one call it. When the most time, take me around the world representing Guyana. Well, in the band now, the different element in the band, we have the steel, we have the, the blow blow, the man is called the five, 
this kettle we have the mad cow we have the board we have the long lady then there's a big tall lady not a big body one because it's two different within them so you got no difference and the masquerade step you have nine steps whatever much you are the nine steps you know the masquerade have your nine steps and I, I will demonstrate a few to you so at least you could get the ideas of the stepping mask and how far I come from. Now this is the first step. You got a circle. This is a circle. They say is old lady going to market. This is a front flick. The back flick. This is a stumble. Then you go down and pick up the money. Right? So there is a few steps of masquerade, but on the road you can see a little more just tell me and give you a little thing more. But this is a slight demonstration of masquerade, how we passionate for culture to keep alive. And we just begging Guyanese or people around the world just to embrace us and let me get this African tradition living because our gospel is women. Where our race is women. So we just want to embrace this culture and enough love. Just, well, you know the pandemic with us. Wear your mask, sanitize. Take your vaccine. There is a protocol of Guyana and enough love for the emancipation. Thank you very much, Guyana.
There's a, there's a, there's a hard by itself. <laughs> I always get on. Just lean back. Yeah, you have to go up the same. Lean back so you can't get back in balance like this. Up and come up. up. I'll show you how to go back and back. Can't go back like this. You gotta go and check a breeze like this. Oh, you got breath. So yeah. yeah. If you stick a motion, we'll do something like this. Up. Oh. <laughs>